Welcome to FootballGamePlan.com, where football makes sense. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook, bringing you an Ohio Valley Conference Game of the Week preview between the UT Martin Skyhawks and the Memphis Tigers. Now let's look at the Skyhawks in this ball game. One thing you notice about these guys right off the bat, huge wide receivers. I don't think there's anybody under six foot three on the Skyhawks roster, so they're gonna have to play above the rim versus that secondary of the Memphis Tigers. If they can win some of those battles, they can have some success throwing the football downfield down there in the Liberty Bowl, but they have to play above the rim. And I look at quarterback Derek Carr. He had a solid year last season. 25 touchdowns, 10 interceptions, Cut down on those interceptions, and he's going to have another phenomenal campaign. There's a lot of reasons why many people like the Skyhawks in the OVC this year. So keep an eye on that. Like I said, play above the rim. Take advantage of those shots down the field. You have the size advantage from the receivers in the cornerback position. Now let's look at the Memphis Tigers in this ball game. So funny because what I just said for UT Martin, I can make the same case for the Memphis Tigers. They have to play above the rim. They have some huge wide receivers. Guys like Martin Rucker and also uh, Kevin Martin. Those guys are outstanding as far as making plays downfield. The question is, you look at the run defense. They have to show up. Because you look at the talented tailbacks for UT Martin, Jason McNair, and Tevin Barksdale. Those guys can really run the football. Memphis loses a lot up front. They lose a guy uh, just got drafted in the first round to the Kansas City Chiefs. They lose him up front. Don Terry Poe's name just slipped my mind. They have to show up in that run defense because I believe UT Martin can run the football. Memphis has to get these guys in obvious passing situations so that way they, they can effectively cover those wide receivers. So you look at this matchup on paper, you look at the teams on film, I have to go with UT Martin. Right now, the balance in the running game, the opportunities to throw the football deep down the field and their defense is aggressive, aggressive and I have some questions about the offense. New scheme with Justin Fuentes down there in Memphis. I'm going with the Skyhawks to pull off the FCS versus FBS upset in week one.